Google recently added a brand new feature to its ever popular Gmail app that now lets users compose an email and schedule it to send at a later date and time. If you ask me, then this new feature is a real savior because I always tend to forget to send my emails on time. Be it mailing my boss about my weekly schedule, which I always forget, or just last week when it saved me by sending a happy birthday mail to a colleague while I was traveling over the weekend. This new addition lets you schedule emails for a later time, which really sounds excellent. Let me show how you can do it, whether you are using Gmail on Android, iOS or the web. Let's get started. Open Gmail and tap Compose from the bottom right. Add a recipient, enter a subject and compose your email. Once done, tap the three dot icon on the top right and select Schedule Send. Select an option or enter your own by selecting Pick Date and Time. Once you tap your selected option, on the next prompt, hit OK. And now the email will be scheduled to send at your preferred date and time. If you wish to cancel a scheduled email, open the menu by tapping the hamburger icon on the top left and select scheduled. Now select your email that you wish to cancel and on the next screen hit cancel. The cancel email then goes to drafts. If you wish to make changes to it then head back to drafts, make changes to it and then you can either schedule to send it on a later date and time or you can directly send it. On your computer, hit the Compose button from the top left of the screen. Add a recipient, enter a subject and compose your email. Once done, right next to the Send button, click the downward facing arrow to reveal Sending options. Now hit Schedule Send. Select an option or enter your own by selecting Pick Date and Time. And that's all, your email will be scheduled to send. Now to cancel it, select Scheduled from the left panel Select your email and tap Cancel Send. The Compose email screen will appear immediately. Now either you can discard the mail or you can make changes and schedule it for a later date and time or simply send it. There are two things to note. First one that you guys might have already noticed is that when you cancel a scheduled email, then it automatically gets saved as a draft. Also, you can schedule up to 100 emails as of now, not more than that. So that's all for this video. Thanks for watching and for all things tech, log on to gadgets360.com.